Right then, today we're back and we are going into Derbyshire, which means only one thing. The big coat is coming back. It's not, I just went downstairs and got this as a prop. So, it's still summer in my eyes, that's what it is. Yes, no, all joking aside, we're back with another match today. We're back with the National League North today, yes. We're heading off to Buxton against Russia Olympic. I'm looking forward to it because I was like going to Buxton and last season, it finished, well, we did a video moments ago. Bruh. But yeah, um, yeah, that was, it was a game that was a bit, yeah, I'm totally honest. But today, I think, I think there'll be a few goals in this game today. And to be honest, I've got two clubs that I've got a lot of respect for and it'd be great to have them back. If you're new around new, of course, like, subscribe to the channel on the way to 3,000 subscribers. And yeah, road trip for me today, which I'm looking forward to. So yeah, we'll see you up in Buxton. Right, I'm here in Buxton and one of the things I remember from Smith was does Buxton actually sell Buxton Spring Water now in the comments? I think I'll try and find it. There isn't. Let's actually see, let's go on the hunt and actually see if Buxton Football Club has Buxton Spring Water. <laughs> right then, so I'm on the road, I'm on the mission to find Buxton Spring Water. I'd say cracking tunes on the go right now at the ground. Right, I'm here in the ground. Let's go and find ourselves some spring water. Never thought for life for me that I'd actually book some spring water would actually take over the channel. Maybe an ad or maybe a sponsor for a video at some point. Well, they've got it on the shirts. That means it's got to be here somewhere. No idea like I'm missing the trick, but I'll tell you what. Yeah, it's great to be back though. It's uh, a books and all joking aside, but yeah. Could be a great game today. Both teams are a bit of a, a slow start to the season, but you never know. A victory like this could probably spring into mind, to be fair. Look at that. Buxton Water. I've actually got it. Props to Chris over there. He's actually got me a, bo a Buxton Water. <laughs> he didn't have to, but legend. Absolute legend. The Bush Hall Reedy guy is getting the best clips. To be fair, I'm actually... There we go. That's a bit better. <laughs> I've actually got two water balls. That's brilliant. <laughs> that's a great shot. <laughs> Look, it's the little things in life, okay, that just makes... Well, makes the world go round. That's uh, we go to Harcourt Russell Massey. You've turned up. Fair play from Walsall. Fair play. So mid-table clash whilst uh, the Beatles are playing over this. One, over this will get copyrighted. But yeah, uh, both teams have had a slow start to the season. Um, do you know what? I fancy Russell Olympic today for some reason. I, I don't know why. I just do. I'm going to go two-one Russell today. Yeah. I don't know. I just just something about it today. I just think that this game's there to be won for both teams today and. Surprisingly, it is unseasonably warm in Buxton. Normally, it's uh, extra layer time. Here we go with them. And we're off. Uh... Hey, look, there's a boxer dog I see right there, and he's got a nice front row seat to this game right here. I could appreciate a bit of atmosphere from Buxton. The reason why there's not much to vlog at the moment because someone's down, but yeah, it's uh, trying to rain as well. Luckily, I need a haircut at some point. If I'm going to make a prediction who's going to score, I think the number nine for Buxton is going to be the best shout. Go on then, 1v1 him then. 1v1 him. Ball. Surely. Woo. Oh. Oh, ball. Ravenhill, surely, oh, oh no. Almost my pick score in there. Him. Oh, book him ref, book him, book him ref. I might change my pick, I might go 23 to be uh, the first goal scorer. No, I'm not, I'm sticking with nine, yes. Very snazzy Adidas Predators, I'll give him that. Free kick! He's given a free kick! Oh! <laughs> They're thinking he's scored, now it's a free kick! He's given a free kick! Oh, did that cross the line? I don't know if that crossed the line. He never, he never crossed the line. Oh! Look at the line, that was probably the maddest 30 seconds I've ever seen of football. Madness. Okay, now 22. Ray and Ravenel, big up my own sound, Donny. Great lad. They're away. Gotta play this right. Oh! Oh, surely! Yeah. 
I know the fans are happy now. 1 0 to Buxton. Maybe a bit of justice, really. I can tell the Buxton goalkeeper right now is your goalkeeper will stick out like a sore thumb. Oh, he's still missed. He's still missed. How's he missed? Yeah. How's he missed that? Oh dear. And I thought I'd seen the miss of the season on Tuesday. That is. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's another great chance. Can't keep squandering these, Russell. I really, honestly. Yeah. The oh, Buxton fans still, still singing. Way. Bit of quality then. Bit of quality. Oh, surely! Yes! Two nil. Run, Josh! Oh, sickness for Russell that. Well, they're going crazy in the stands, aren't they? Yeah, oh, free kick. Ooh, what a chance here. Let's see if they score. Here we go then. Oh, is it the bar? Bloody hell. For some effort. Way again. Oh. Oh. Oh, what a save. What a save, Keats. Yeah, some quality there. I'll tell, tell you that right now. Some quality saves it the last couple of videos, I have to say. Well, there we go. The longest first half that I've seen. <laughs> so far, so, this is 2 0. To be honest, I think Bucks would have been, I think they'd be brilliant first half, taking the goals well. I mean, yeah, I, I, if I'm totally honest, I did think it was a foul on the goalkeeper, but look, the keeper's always going to get advantage with that. But I think Russell have been okay, they've been okay in patches, but they have grown into the game. But as soon as they've grown into the game, they can see the goal. But that's been their biggest problem as well. And it's worrying when they've only had probably two shots. I think they've had two or three shots in the first half. That's going to be the worrying thing, but look, still a long way to go. If they get the next goal, it's game on. That's for sure. Back on the way. I didn't realise the Paolo Maldini is actually in attendance today. Go on then. What's going on? On the way. Oh, what a shame. What an habit. Oh, have it. Oh, yes. Go on then. My post. Free header. Two and three! Two and three! I've got short. Oh! I'll tell you what, that would have been a fair play. That would have been a great goal. Just saying, we've not seen over a kick goal this season. We might see one today. Goal kicking off down here. Yeah, a bit of handbags, I think, with that one. Oh. Oh, he's lost it! <laughs> Bloody hell. Oh, oh dear. That's a chance. That was a chance. Oh! Oh, where's the catch slide? Come on. I found someone wearing a woolly hat. Is it officially summer season over now then? And then bottom right, then to seal the victory, then. Oh, he's missed! He's missed! He's missed! Oh. Well then. There we go. Victory. And we'll speak in a sec. Debrief. So we go, I'm back. Um, I felt Buxton deserved the victory today. I thought they were very good. Going forward, um, I thought the attacking play was was very good to their felt they, they linked up well and took the goals well. Took the goals well, and I felt like Russell had moments, but when you're missing from two or three yards out, it, it's always going to be difficult. It, you just know it's not going to be your day. Um, I felt, you know, the, probably the big decision in the first half, I didn't think it was a foul. Look, the keeper's going to get advantage, but. It was never a foul. It was never over the line either. It was probably about that much. They still needs to go over the line. But, look, it was a good win for Buxton. They needed it. Rushall, it's going to be tough. It's going to be tough for them this season. It's 
let's say you know they've had the new manager, they've had a load of players coming in, big overhaul at the football club. It's yeah, I, I, I can see them fighting relegation again, but we'll see. Hopefully, you know I've got a lot of respect for for Russell. I do hope they stay up. Um, it's going to be a long season for them. Buxton, they'll be. Uh, I'll be looking at the playoffs, I think, but look, it's a long way to go. Long way to go. If you're new around here, of course, like, subscribe to the channel. And yeah, we're back on Tuesday. Big game, massive, massive game, yes. Peace.